Y'all see this. Now let's talk about it. In 1992, Wesley Snipes and Woody Harrison that came out with a movie called White Man Can't Jump. And it was the joke of all white kids in school. It was so funny. And the funny part about it, it was true because white people didn't have hops. White people couldn't jump. When you go to the basketball court, you ain't choosing a white person. If they can't shoot threes like JJ Reddick can, we we, we ain't we ain't we, we ain't picking old no 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 Caucasian. We ain't picking that that skin tone to play on our basketball team. But in 2023, in 2023, the NBA dunk contest brought us. This right here. Some boy he gonna go down. Oh. 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 <clears throat> Matt McClung single-handedly put the world on notice that white men can jump. It's not a myth no more. We cannot sit around and say that white men cannot jump after we just saw this six foot two, 24 year older go to the dunking contest and score fifties across the board. All them black men, African American was dunking. They were looking good and everything and whatnot. He came up, he showed up and he showed out. So right now that movie, white man can't jump. With, with with Wesley Snipes and Woody Harrison. It was a non-fictional movie. That movie is now fictional. It's fake and it's full of it. Matt McClung, you get your props from me and from everybody else. I know the only words you had to say was white man can't jump. And that's on everything.